Hey, what's going on guys? It's Jonathan Smith. I want to come to you guys because a lot of people want to know my story and find out, you know, how did I become a millionaire before I'm even 28 years old? And a lot of people think that maybe things were handed to me or, you know, oh, dad wrote the check and he got a million dollar loan from his dad, you know, but uh, that's not the case. I actually went through the school of hard knocks. I got a bunch, lost it all and brought it back together. And I'm going to tell you the story. So I started out right out of high school. Uh, I had other plans. I wasn't even going to go into real estate. In fact, when I was on my 16th birthday, my grandma, I told her, hey, I got this great idea. I'm going to become a real estate agent. Now, my grandma had been a realtor in the late 70s and early 80s. And she told me absolutely not. I had to either go into the military or go to college. And she preferred college. And so I was going to go into the military. And through a series of events, that never actually ended up happening. And I was studying to become a personal trainer when my best friend's dad came into Starbucks where I was studying at the time, and he goes, hey, I think that you would like real estate. And I had already thought about going into real estate a few years earlier when I was 16. And so I ended up meeting with him and deciding that I did, in fact, want to go into real estate. And I started on my real estate courses that night. Now, I worked for him for about a year and a half and decided I wanted to go into a bigger market. And so I moved to Orange County, California. Now, I don't know if you know anything about Orange County, California, but it is ultra competitive and ultra expensive. So I'm living life out there. I was living in a house that was $4,200 a month between me and two roommates. The utility bills were over $1,000 every month. I mean, it is super expensive. I'm putting 50 to 100 miles a day on my car driving all around the city and all that starts to add up. And so um, for a while I'm living on my credit cards, you know, I don't have any money in my bank. There was one point where my bank account was negative $900, you know, and you're still swiping the credit card. I was buying the books and going to events and really trying to learn um, and everything just started falling apart and crashing. I lost a bunch of deals all at one time. I had enough deals at one time to pay off all my debt and I lost it all within a one week period. Uh, my car ended up getting repoed. My roommates wanted to kick me out because I couldn't pay my rent. I mean, I was borrowing money. I was selling all of my stuff just to buy ramen noodles. This is a true story. And I got an opportunity to come back and go back to the very first office that I started with. He was getting ready to retire and wanted to sell his business. So I moved back, I had a perfect opportunity and I started rebuilding, rebuilding, learning more about finance, learning more about credit. When I moved back, I had like a 420 credit score. I mean, I didn't even know that, that, that it went that low. And so I had to learn, hey, how do I get back on the top? Because I knew that I couldn't stay you know, at 400 credit and start buying property. I knew I had to get that fixed. So I learned everything I could about credit. I started learning about finance, how to save, how to budget, how to really, you know, get everything paid off. So I got everything paid off and I bought my very first property and then I bought another one and another one and I sold a few of them. I flipped a few houses and really started to grow my portfolio to where it is today at 22 rental units. And I'm going to share with you everything that I learned so that you don't make the same mistakes I did and so that you could build it even faster than I did uh, because I think everybody's capable of doing what I've done. So I'm going to bring all that to you so that you could do exactly what I did. Hey guys, if you want to learn about real estate investing, credit, and finance, you're going to want to like and subscribe because I'm going to bring all of this to you and more. You're not going to want to miss anything because together, uh, over the next few years, we're going to grow this thing real nice and big. And I'm looking forward to you coming along with me and buying some extra real estate.